All right, hi, welcome to my latest video tasting installment. This is a, a whole family edition. So you, these are my children, Bowden, smile to the camera, and Iris. Okay, tonight we're doing the Thomas Hooker Hot Meadow IPA. It's made in Connecticut, and uh, Hooker makes some really good stuff. Most highly rated um, Doppelbox on Beer Advocate, so that's worth something. There we go. Now, here goes the pour. What do you think? Gray! What color? Red! Okay. You want to smell it first? Uh huh. Okay. Smells yucky. Okay, do you like the smell though? No. Okay, it's got a beautiful clear color. It's a little hazy. It is reddish, like copper. The smell is actually kind of faint, it's mildly of hops. And it's so mild that you can take it anywhere you like. <laughs> we love you. Alright, so it's got a mild, hoppy smell. We love you. Yes. yes. It's so hot. I don't pick up anything else. I feel like my nose is broken, but uh, it's probably like going to be pretty well balanced. Yeah. 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 The hop flavor is really good, though, and the bitterness also. I get to be talking. Oh, well, I'll, I'll, how about if I... Uh, I'll ask you a question and then you can talk, okay? Okay. All right, here, Bo, you go down. Okay, Iris, do you think this is a pretty beer? Yes. Why? Because it looks like it's either red and either brown, which is the color of my hair. Oh, very nice. And you think this is a pretty bottle? Yeah, because it has the color of my hair, too. Okay, because it's a brown bottle. Thomas Hooker, marketing to children. So. And beautiful children that love dresses. Of course, and there's Iris's beautiful dress. Now I'm going to talk about the beer for a minute. Okay. Black bear! There's a black bear under the table. I'm very scared. So that's it. It's a good IPA. I can't have much more of a detailed analysis than that given my circumstances. But uh, what we have here is a mild smell, but uh, a great flavor. Really nice IPA flavor, dirty, hoppy, bitter. It's just what you'd want from an IPA made in Connecticut. It doesn't say that ABV or IBU, but the IBU will probably be pretty high, like, I don't know, 60 maybe? I mean, not super high. And the alcohol seems like a little on the reserve side. So I'm happy with it. I would recommend it. And the taste just has a great, a great crisp assertive of bitterness. It's not too, not too heavy, but... Uh, but really, what you'd want from an IPA, you can tell it's not a pale ale, it's an IPA. So, if you get Hooker distributed near you, it's made in Connecticut. If you get it near you, pick it up. And if you don't, then ask for it. Who knows, maybe they'll bring it on. Thanks for watching. And, uh, the uh, you don't need to talk into the microphone, just talk to the camera. Oh, no, talk in the microphone. No, no, don't press the red button. Here, talk to the microphone then. Microphone. Talk. Hi. Okay. All right, we're live. What are you going to say? You don't need to talk into the microphone. Okay, fine. Hello. Hello. Hey, it's not recording for me. It is recording. Look, see the red light is on. Hello. I don't feel like it. It is the 